So you might be having an issue where for some reason you're getting this little pop-up that says it couldn't sign you in. So it basically means that within your Android device or whatever device, even if you're on google.com, it might be telling you that it couldn't sign you into a specific website. And it says, you know, thanks for confirming that you can access whatever. Unfortunately, Google couldn't verify that whatever. The reason why this is happening is because you probably had either failed to type in your password correctly too many times, or you verified it, like there's some verification thing that ended up coming through. You did type in your password correctly, but you just did the verification wrong or you typed in the wrong numbers. Things like that can happen. So the best thing you can do for the most part is to go ahead and just try re-signing into your account. So go back into the page that you needed to go to in order to actually you know, basically go ahead and you know, sign into your account. So if you're pretty much just going to like google.com, you can just straight up go to google.com like this and you can try re-signing into your account, whatever account you're trying to sign into, if it was Google, if it was a different website. And what you're going to want to do there is you want to go ahead and just re-sign into your account, but make sure when the verification process happens, if it's requiring you to like type in your specific like you know security code, if it's typing, if it's sending you a text and you type in that code from the text, whatever that process is, you're going to have to make sure that within that specific process in and of itself, you're typing in all the right information. Now, if that's still not working, you may want to give it a few moments. You may have locked out yourself out of your account. It even gives you an option of using another account. So just wait a few minutes and try redoing the same exact process. Again, I would probably argue that for a lot of people out there, that's probably all you're going to have to do, and that'll probably end up fixing it. Now, if you forgot your password or if you forgot your sign-in information, but you still have your login information for all your other pages, what you can always do is you can always click on the forgot password option. So what you can do is if I go into this little sign-in area, I can just click sign in. And if I forgot my password or my email, I can click on forgot email and I can go ahead and recover my email if I need to. Or if I forgot my password, there's also a forgot password option that comes up from the specific page. And you can also recover your password that way as well, or just change your password at that point. So those are pretty much the main things to do when you're in that situation. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.